All right. As you can see here, we have a brand new version of 3ds Max uh, 2013 installed. Um, I've changed my layout. This way, you can see some extra tools um, that you might not be familiar with. As you open 3ds Max and this color also, but I uh, went into my computer on my software and. Uh, change the, the look and feel of the software um, by going into custom UI and default switcher and by setting my initial settings to Max and V-Ray and default UI don't worry about that alright I'll go to you can see here that I'm orbiting uh, and we create a shape this is a box maximize the viewport um, center it alright as you can see I have a shape here simple box um, basically I'm orbiting around this shape by just holding down my middle mouse button or the scroll wheel just pressing it down and orbit nothing to it in the older versions of 3ds max uh, which is 2012 and beneath you had to hold on alt plus this middle mouse button to orbit or you had to come here down here to this right hand corner and click this orbit button and then you could orbit uh, your object or you could just hold down uh, and this uh, new feature 3ds max has added um, called view cube but it's much faster if you just hold on a middle mouse button as you can see here yeah it's much more intuitive and it gives you time to work so how do you do this? Uh, it's only available in 3ds Max 2013 and let me show you. You go to customize user interface, go to uh, mouse and all you have to do is click on uh, arc rotate, come here, shortcut, you're gonna see a different command in this shortcut uh, menu here for when you just add 3ds max when if you click on just click arc rotate shortcut hold down the middle mouse button you're gonna see mmb pop up here just click assign save and save a ui that's it other thing i did was to change my pan uh, the way i pan in 3ds max to match that of google sketchup which is I hold on a shift key which is uh, usually to your left and the middle mouse button so I just clicked in this clicked on this pan view shift plus mm button you won't see shift plus mmb here just clicked on when you just start 3ds max 2013 so you just click here hold on shift and then middle mouse button assign save and basically that's it now you'll be able to move just as i do in 3ds max which is much more intuitive um, and i'll write more about this on my blog please check it out um, and enjoy thank you this is a presentation from midford and we'll see you later